Hello everyone, this is Dr. Praveen Tripathi and with me is Dr. Pranati Singh who got a rank of 183 in the INICT exam. Pranati, many, many congratulations, Bita. Thank you so much, sir. So how Thank are you, you feeling? How does it feel? Uh, sir, I am feeling out of this world right now. I don't know how to explain how I'm feeling right now. <laughs> and and so Pranati, tell me, what were uh, so you, you completed your internship somewhere in March, right? Yeah, 28th March, sir. sir. And, and from where, from where? From Malana Azad Medical College. Oh, you're from MC. Oh, wonderful. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, so you completed your internship in March and you have appeared for May INICT, yes, then uh, PG and then this. So, so what were your ranks in May INICT? What was your rank? Uh, sir, in May INICT, my rank was about 3000. Uh, in NEET PG, my rank was uh, 2143. Uh, two, mm. And in uh, May INICT, my rank is 183. And the most interesting thing that you told me was that after NEET PG, you joined a job. And yes, sir. The last two months you have been studying along with the job. And this is the yeah, right yes, job. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Truly totally exceptional. So, Pranati, uh, now we would like to understand in more details how did you go about it, what all did you use, and how it helped you. So, first of all, we were talking about uh, uh, the marathon programs, right? So, so I think that that is how you started the becoming a part of mission. So, so what exactly yes, was the story? Tell us. Uh, yes, sir. So initially, I was uh, a, an only BTR subscriber yeah. because in internship I had time to only do that. BTR, but yeah. uh, when my internship got over, I thought that I can still work on some of my subjects and some of my concepts. Mm -hmm. And at, at that time, marathon uh, INI for the INI came. So mm -hmm. that attracted me and all the teachers at Cerebellum, I already know they're amazing because I've studied from most of them at some point in my MBBS. Mm -hmm. So I was really attracted. So I immediately subscribed to the full mission plan. Mm -hmm. And then I started with uh, started with the working on the subjects which I thought were weak. For example, surgery mm -hmm. and uh, some topics of medicine, pharma, psychiatry. So I think I did not spend enough time in MBBS. So I gave one full attempt at uh, reading psychiatry from you, from mm -hmm. Cerebellum and most of the teachers, like most, I in summary, I can say that I have used everything in the app. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so that's how I started with it, that I started with my uh, the things which I thought I was lacking at and then I moved forward with that. So, so the journey started with BTR by Dr. Zainab. Yes, so, so you completed the BTR and then used these things or was this happening simultaneously? Uh, yes, sir. Actually, uh, uh, I completed BTR uh, mm -hmm. till the end of my internship. Mm -hmm. But still, uh, my ranks in GTs were not uh, able to match up with what I wanted because I knew that I lagged in some concepts. Okay. So that is why I thought that I need to work on them. And mm -hmm. that is when I bought the whole plan. Your factual information became good, but you thought good, that... Yeah, yes, sir. My rank definitely good. improved with mm -hmm. BTR, like a lot. But yeah. I knew that, you know, you know those 10, 20 questions that will you will only get correct when your concepts will be good. So that's when I thought that... Okay, so I you should. are telling me that you use most of the things. So so I, I just want to understand from students uh, what benefits them and in what way. So let's talk about the mission live classes. So were you able to do them live or would you watch the videos later, uh, recorded videos? Sir, actually, uh, when I joined, most of the classes were already recorded. Okay. So the ones which were already already recorded, I saw those recorded lectures. And okay. whenever I got the time or whenever I thought that I can join a live class, I joined the live class. And I can definitely say that the live classes are like better. You should attend the classes live. That is much better than watching the recorded. Like personally, for me, that was better because my focus was better. Uh, mm -hmm. And I it used to look like a real class. So I could not leave and right. I could not pause. So, yeah. W would you get that FOMO that if I, if I pause the class or if I go somewhere, I'll miss, miss a topic? Because uh, that is what but, you want. Uh, you want but I always, door. I try yeah. to not do this uh, mm -hmm. in the live classes. But uh, I always had that in like back in my mind that if I, I'll miss something, I'll always have the option of uh, seeing it from the recorded lectures. Understood. Another thing that you used a lot, uh, Praniti, was late night PYQ sessions. Yes, sir. So how how did it help you and uh, what, what was uh, your mind when you used it diligently? Sir, I think PYQ marathon is like a gold stuff. I mean, uh, because I used to do PYQs, but... Uh, I was not really those, I could not really figure out uh, what I know, what I don't know and how much PYQ should I do. Mm -hmm. So when uh, Cerebellum came up with this PYQ marathon, I, I have not missed even one PYQ marathon. Like at least before NEET, I have not missed even one. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, that helped me, like that gave me a lot of confidence that, okay, if I can solve the questions of 
the exams that have gone by i can solve the questions of this year also and uh, that gave me a confidence that my concepts are also good so mm-hmm. yeah and, and uh, we also used to get ranks in our pyq marathon and i know that you always said that we should not compare our ranks but i had a study partner and you know that was a motivation for us to study more and you know we used to compare our ranks and that used to be like a motivation for us that we have to study more so that we can get a better rank so so a uh, comparison whether it is fruitful or not depends on how we take it i mean if if we can you know say that okay my friend is getting better rank than me and if she can so can i then it's a good thing but yes, if we start feeling yaar i am not doing anything she is doing better then it's a bad thing so i am sure you took it in the right way and that's yes, right sir, yes sir yes sir yes uh, sir so we tend to do a lot of uh, live tests and discussions also pranthi in the app so did you use them and uh, was it beneficial yeah EMB. yes sir all all the i have i given all the tests and discussions hmm. of uh, need the the first like before the postponement and after the postponement also Okay. I have given all the TNDs. Mm-hmm. Uh, I could not give the I N I TNDs because I had a job. I could not match with the time. But mm-hmm. I tried watching the videos at least so that okay. I can uh, catch up with the questions. Okay. So uh, yes, sir. I have uh, used all the tests and discussion. And uh, teachers used to bring all the important topics in those tests. So mm-hmm. that also covered a lot of our syllabus. So yeah, and a lot of questions from those tests actually came in the exams also. So yeah. Yeah, in E N D is the focus is to you know test the students on those questions that are likely to come in the exam. So so that is always the aim. Uh, you you did a strange thing, Pranati, that you joined the C G H S job after NEET P G. So yeah. what what was going in your mind? Because you were continuing with the preparation as well. So did this thought yeah. come that uh, if I am in a job, maybe I would not get as much time? And how how did you balance it? Sir, actually, uh, uh, I thought that. Uh... i already had a rank in neat pg and i remember you sending a message on the cerebellum group that uh, you always regret not preparing for ini because and you always motivated all of us to you know keep preparing for ini so when i already had this in mind that i have a rank and i can get a college of my choice so why not give it a shot and since i had a very good you know job option so i did not want to leave that also because that was also based on merit so i did not want to leave that so i joined the job and i tried to use my time as much as possible and i used my time there also like uh, since i have a computer based job i used my time there also by doing the pyq marathons and by trying to do as many mcqs as possible so so uh, sitting at the job and when you would get time you would try to do the questions and the mcqs yes right? sir yes sir Uh, another thing i want to ask you pranati uh, these marathon sessions the la- classes not the test marathon the classes marathon that that we do right before the exam did, did you use those and uh, did you yes sir yes sir i used to those classes uh, before the neat pg marathon okay. before the neat pg uh, yeah. this time i could not uh, use them much because of again lack of time but before neat pg i i had used them and maybe i think i give full credit because uh, uh if not those classes i would not have had the uh you know the confidence that okay i have studied in the last 10 days and i used my those notes in these times also like before the ini also i tried to see my 20th notebook and everything wherever i had jotted down the important points so that i knew that uh, those are the important topics so i tried to cover them and uh, whenever possible i tried to see the recorded lectures of the marathon of this time also so so preparing with the job i mean if if somebody is in two minds that should i take up a job or should i not and study solely what is what is your advice to that person that uh, yeah uh, sir i think that uh, it depends from person to person to person honestly if you think that you can manage with a job uh, mm-hmm. you should go for it because like personally if i tell you about myself i don't think that i can study 24 hours Mm-hmm. so you know being with a job actually gave me that pressure that okay i have less time and i have to use it uh, to the best of my capability mm-hmm. so that actually helped me more okay. that i have since i have less time so i have to use it more mm-hmm. so if if i would have had the whole day to myself i would not have studied uh, this well w- were you expecting such a great rank pranati no sir honestly not because i thought that uh, you know everybody gives a lot of time for pre- preparation and uh, i just went with the uh, little preparation and a lot of concepts that i had learnt in during my neat preparation but mm-hmm. yeah it uh, worked <laughs> do you think pyqs and pyts are still important when we go for the exams 
yes sir i totally i totally agree i mean uh, like i told you uh, the the maximum time that i gave during my this uh, ini preparation was to pyqs and pyts only like mm-hmm. the pyq marathons and the topics that i had written during the time of neat so mm-hmm. because uh, i could use only that and that has has only helped me in this in like during when i was attempting the exam also i could feel that i have done these questions no, if not the same similar questions i have done them so mm-hmm. that that really helped pyqs and pyts are most important so uh, can we say that in the last couple of months your focus was was more on solving the mcqs uh, rather than anything else and, and that that helped you can we can we yes, say yes solving questions and uh, uh, the previous year topics not topics, like just the questions know. topics i mean oh. if you know that uh, you know this particular question is being asked in different forms mm. multiple times that means the topic is very important mm. so that way i focused on the topic more so mm. yeah wonderful w- were you always a good student uh, during your, your mbbs days were you like a topper I, i would not say i was a like a topper but i was uh, like a decent student sir yeah <laughs> okay wonderful wonderful so pranthi what next so what are you planning to pick uh sir uh, my choices were medicine and obs gynae for neat pg if med- if not medicine then obs gynae mm-hmm. and uh, i try for the same in ini ct also so whatever uh wonderful it was it was so nice talking to you pranati it is such a nice thank you sir you know, the 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 part that impresses me the most is that uh, job part that uh, despite having a job uh, i mean you can think in such a way that you have limited time and you, you can increase on your uh, productivity so that is yes, what you did and you have got such a beautiful rank Well done. So happy for you, and uh, may God bless you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you to you and all the teachers at Cerebellum, like everybody. Thank you so much, sir. But before we end this interview, what is your message to your juniors who today uh, have gotten such a great rank, who are having self doubts, who don't know what to do next? What is your message, uh, sir? If I have to say just one thing, I would say like don't overthink mm-hmm. about your potential, and just go for it. Give you all hundred percent. The results will take care of itself. Wonderful. That's And, amazing. Yeah. Thank you, Bhanti. Well done. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.